this is Steve Carrington, Mayor for Palmer, Alaska, taking you five days into the future for our October 24th City Council meeting. In my marriage report, I report on the MVP MPO, which MVPMPO.com is their website. Uh, I included attached the minutes from the last meeting in September. Uh, they've submitted the packet to the state, to the governor's office, I think back on October 9th. And then at the last meeting I was at, we approved the Unified Planning Work Program document, uh, which was updated and now it is uh, published out on their website and is open for 30 days of public comment. So if you feel like it, go check out MVP to MPO.com and check out that plan and comment on it. Then also a Palmer Library update. Uh, there's progress, but it feels like a glacier. It's glacial in its speed. But um, we're doing another input meeting, I think November 15th. I believe that's like a Wednesday, um, probably from 4 to 6 p.m. at the Palmer Depot. Uh, there's, it's, I keep calling it a blob city where they, they make all these blobs of different color to represent different functions of the library and how they interact. And uh, come check it out November 15th and see how it goes. And um, I think uh, the, we've scheduled for December 12th, the architect, Gary Wolf and company will come and present to the council. And at that time, we hope they will have some uh, pro probable costs for construction versus reconstruction alternatives uh, as far as the library goes so that the council can look at that and uh, maybe make a decision on which direction we want to go. Uh, looks like the Matsu Borough is also working on a comprehensive plan update. And in my uh, packet, I give a link to where people can uh, read what's up and uh, get involved with that. They have some various uh, locations where they're encouraging public input everywhere from Colony High, Reddington, Junior, Senior, Tealin Middle School, Butte Elementary, Sioux Valley, Glacier View, Houston Middle. And they're also planning a couple virtual meetings online in December. In January, they'll start working on... Uh, schematic presentation for the council I think by the end of the month in January and the library bond passed and a, people, a lot of people have asked what does that mean how much does it cost what are we doing and it's like well we don't really know I mean, we've gotten five million from the state uh, we're hoping to get maybe three million from the insurance uh, with the damage to the library once we have a plan in place, we can start approaching other uh, resources and other organizations for um, grants, et cetera, for building a library. But we kind of have to have the plans set up and working for that to go. Uh, but we haven't, you know, in the 20 some years that I've been involved in the city of Palmer, we haven't changed our sales tax. It's been 3% since the 90s. Uh, we haven't changed the mill rate, I think, since the same amount of time. It's been three mills for all that amount of time. So. I don't see us doing anything different on that front. It's going to be a matter of we're looking at budgets now. Or, you know, I plan to ask lots of questions about, okay, what if we did a $4 million bond or a $5 million bond or a $6 million bond? What's the cost? How many years does it take to pay that back? What What is that cost per year so that we can look at, okay, how would we approach that in our budget? How would we be paying that? So October 17th, we had a lot of the department heads presenting to the council and talking about what are the different uh, things that are changing their budget, what's going on, how, how are things are looking. And we are planning to have some more um, discussions on the 24th. And we've penciled in another meeting for, I think, November 7th. Um, hoping to take the 31st. We, we tend to meet on Tuesdays, even in between meetings, but the 31st of October is Halloween, and I think some of us may have parties to go to that day. So. We're going to try to take that time off, but November 7th will be probably another budget meeting. We'll be asking more questions. And that's most of what will be happening. Oh, we also have the audit. Um, thanks to some of the different restraints involved with the federal uh, Gatsby Act, etc., it takes a long time for us to get our audit. So our 2022 audit is now coming to us on the 24th of October, which is slow, but because of the different parts and pieces of, of how things move, it takes a while to get that. So that'll be presented to the council on October 24th. 
And then there's a bunch of discussion about the budget. That's most of what the meeting will be. So, thanks. This has been Steve Carrington, Mayor of Palmer, Alaska, taking you five days into the future for the October 24th City Council meeting.